Today we had uh, the three counties here. Uh, the best from Makueni, the best from uh, Kitui, and the best from uh, uh, Yamachakos. And uh, they had an opportunity to showcase their talent. And I believe about uh, five to six of them have been identified for the provisional squad that will be called later. So we can say we have done uh, a great thing, especially in youth. So I truly appreciate the coaches who have been also handling this youth. For those who did not get an opportunity to be selected, there is the next chance. And we are not disbanding these teams. We will continue to have the under-17 league. So I encourage them to continue playing, bearing in mind there is next time. And they will be, you never know, they will end up being selected. He imekua selection for under 17 national team, which will be taking part in the AFCON qualifiers in Rwanda starting December 13 to 28. Um, so, to give you a, a history of this team, national team, under 17, is that three years ago, in 2017, we did a selection for under 13 players across the whole country. It was done in, in Nakuru, and we picked a team which we have been training since then. But in football, three years is a long time, so what we are doing now, we want to strengthen this team, and so we are going to all the eight regions in the country and selecting the best under-17 players. 2004 born to come and help boost the team that already exists. So we've done so far Nairobi region, we've done Rift Valley, we've done Nyanza, we've done Western, we have done Central. Today we are in Eastern. Um, tomorrow we'll be in the Coast region. On Saturday again we'll be in Eastern but Upper Eastern, that is Meru. And then on Sunday we'll do Northeastern in Garissa. And after that, the selected players will be called to camp in Nairobi on 24th in preparation for the AFCON qualifiers that take place in December in Rwanda. Uh, today we had, I think, two left wingers who are interesting to us, who are in a provisional squad, so we will compare them which the players we have seen, we see, oh, this guy is better, or oh, this guy is better, so we still talk about it as we uh, yeah, rated them. Uh, there has to be a pre-selection, that's one thing. Number two, therefore, we make a tournament normally with four teams, so we can see each player three times. And then uh, I think I have some experience as I worked as a scout in the Center of Excellence from Cologne, three years. So I have some experience also when I worked in the uh, Center of Excellence as sports director. I have also do squad management for under-19 Bundesliga and uh, under-17, under-15. So I have some experience and of course uh, you will normally also make some mis mistakes, it can happen. But if you can get uh, out of 10 players, uh, 7 or 8, uh, and they, they work, then it's, I think, quite okay.